Hey guys, welcome to the Manchester United News Channel. Subscribe to the channel to not miss any news, leave your like, and share, you are very important for the growth of the channel, let's go to the video. Eric Ten Hag makes final decision on Jadon Sancho after Man United dressing room takes sides. Manchester United manager Eric Ten Hag is pushing for Jadon Sancho to be moved on in January, with the winger still banished from all first-team areas at Carrington. Eric Ten Hag has made it clear that there is no way back for Jadon Sancho at Manchester United after pushing for the forward to be sold in January. Sancho, 23, has not played for the Red Devils since the 3-2 win over Nottingham Forest at the end of August after disputing comments Ten Hag made on his poor training performances via social media. Mirror Football revealed last month how the Dutchman has subsequently banned Sancho from all first-team facilities at the club's Carrington training base. The decision to exile Sancho was made after the former Borussia Dortmund star refused to issue an apology to Ten Hag following crisis talks. And with the winger still out in the cold, it seems likely he will be moved on from Old Trafford sooner rather than later. According to the Mail, Ten Hag has been pushing for Sancho to be sold once the transfer window opens in the new year. That would indicate that, as things stand, there is no way back for Sancho, who only joined the Red Devils in a £73 million deal back in the summer of 2021. Although a number of clubs have been tentatively linked with a move for Sancho in recent weeks, United £60 million asking price for a player who has struggled to replicate his prodigious Bundesliga form over the past two years is likely to deter any serious suitors. That could lead to a temporary move rather than a permanent exit for Sancho in January. The same report claims that United would be willing to subsidise a portion of Sancho's £300,000 a week wages in order to facilitate a loan deal. It is understood that the United dressing room recognised there will only be one winner in the ongoing spat. And although there is sympathy for Sancho's feelings on the matter, the consensus is that his response to Ten Hag after being dropped for last month's big game against Arsenal was not on. A source close to the players said, Jadon's teammates have been telling him to back down and say sorry to the boss. They want him to apologise. They sympathise with him and the way he feels, but recognize a line was crossed with what he posted. Thank you all for watching, subscribe to the channel to not miss anything, leave your like and comment it's very important for the channel growth. Until the next video.